All right, guys, and we're getting rid of this steamer. We've been using this steamer for about two years. It's worked great, but it's definitely time for an upgrade. And stay tuned to see what we got. Hello, guys, my name is JC with 559 Mobile Detailing here in Fresno, California. And today, I'm gonna tell you why I'm upgrading to the Chief Steamer. For people who don't know, man, how long you been in business? Um, it's going almost on three years, so two and a half. And can you show us your current steamer? Yeah. What you rocking with, man? Yeah, so let me show you guys. So what I have, what I had right now was a, it's a basic steamer. I mean, it blows steam, it works pretty good, but it just don't work out for me because I will have to refill at least two times when I'm doing a detail. When I refill the steamer, you gotta un untie this right here and to refill the water. So if I open this up, it lets all the pressure out and I will have to wait again so it could repressurize. Now, JC, yeah. some people are gonna wonder, why were you rocking with that steamer for so long okay. if you didn't like it? I mean, this, this steamer did get the job done. So, I mean, it wasn't that I didn't like it. It was just a little inconvenience when it came to refilling or, you know, getting more water inside the steamer. I would have to wait another 10 minutes so it could heat up again. And got yeah, it. time is money. So we definitely got to upgrade that. But one thing is that, I mean, you made it work with what you have. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You know, because a lot of, I know a lot of detailers, yep. they want the big and the baddest right yep. away. Yeah, yeah. So why didn't you upgrade to a cheap steamer right away, in your opinion? It, it, it took me a while to upgrade just due to the cost of the cheap steamer. So the cheap steamer is a little expensive, so that's the only reason why I didn't upgrade before. But let me know, guys, what are you guys rocking for a steamer? Drop it down in the comments down below. And how long did you wait to upgrade your steamer? Let me know. All right, man. So before we get into the cheap steamer, yeah. why the cheap steamer? <laughs> I had a lot of detailers recommend this to me. I also been eyeing this steamer for a very long time already, so it just I just had to pull the trigger and get the cheap steamer. All right, man, we're gonna unbox it. Yeah, let's, let's get, get it. it. So for the details that don't know, man, how much did it hurt your pockets over here? It hurt pretty bad. So this was thirteen hundred dollars. So it wasn't definitely not nothing cheap. This is something a little bit more expensive, but it also has lifetime warranty and it's worth the money if you have it. Got it. Yeah. All right, man. Let's take it down. What do we have? All right. Have you ever played with it? I mean, I kind of play with it a little bit, but this is my first time really playing with it. So, I mean, I took it out the box. I made sure that everything was working properly before we did the video, but this is going to be my first time actually trying it out with all the attachments and everything that came out with it. So this is what we got. This is the hose right here. All the attachments are super easy to clip on. The hose, I believe, is, I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments how long you think this hose is. It looks like a good 10 feet, a I think. 10 feet, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, comparing to the other, the other steamer right here, this was an inconvenience, too, because we had to drag this almost nearly everywhere around the vehicle. So, I mean, it's not like it's short, but it's definitely a lot smaller than this one right here. All right, guys, I'm gonna give you guys a comparison right here on the cheap steamer. Jeez, brand new, JC. Yeah. So hey, let, me, let me ask you something. Yeah. You get excited when you get a new piece of equipment? or is it I like... do get excited, bro. I'm always excited to try a new piece of equipment, especially something in high quality like this. Like Christmas, bro? It's like Christmas all over again right now. Yeah. <laughs> all right, man, all right. What do you, what do you think about it, bro? Looks super shiny. I mean, I know you run into this all the time. Oh, too, yeah. So, I mean, yeah. It's popular, man. Hey, people buy them for a reason, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. so I mean, that's why that's why I purchased this steamer because all the detailers kind of recommend this to me. I reached out to a bunch of detailers and the steamer that they were mentioning was a cheap steamer. So we went ahead and got that. All right, man. So let's look around, man. What do we have yeah. over here? So this is the machine right here. So. It looks pretty well built. Um, like I said, it does have lifetime warranty. Um, they gave me a 10 day uh, return policy. So if I don't like it, I could return it without any cost of my pocket. And I do have affiliated code. Um, it don't cost you anything extra, but if you do want to go ahead and buy it, click the code down below. All right, JC, what we do now, man? All right, so we just refilled the water on this little tank. We're just, we're going to turn it on and see how long it takes to heat up. And guys, this machine only takes tap water. Do you guys know why? Drop it down in the comments down below. 
All right, JC, for the new detailers that don't know, why is the steamer so important? What does it do? Okay, for me, the cheap steamer will come in clutch because it, get, it removes a lot of the junk that's between the cup holders. It cleans a lot faster than just regular scrubbing. And plus, you could also save a lot of chemicals by just using straight only water to clean other than chemicals. I'm just curious, man, yeah. the 1300. Was that the cheapest option? They didn't sell the cheap okay, steamer by themselves? so um, the cheap steamer, this package right here was um, almost what I, like like a thousand something, but the reason why it was $1,300 is because I got an add-on attachment. I haven't got this out the box, so we're gonna check it out right now. <laughs> oh, dang. So this, this right here, this piece right here, it costs, I believe, $299, almost $300 right here. It's like an extractor, but instead of using water, it uses steam, so it's more of a dryer process. It kind of dries a lot faster and it makes, I mean, it's using steam only, so no chemicals, only steam to clean and sanitize. So guys, let me know. Do you guys think this is worth $300? Let me know. Right now, the machine is ready to be used, so once it stops blinking, that means it's ready to go, so let's try it out. It feels really good as well too. So like the materials, it feels good. It looks like it's gonna hold up if I drop it or anything like that, or if it's in my truck, anything hits it. It looks like the plastic is well made. So I mean, I don't think I'm gonna have any issues with breaking anything like that. How do you switch the attachments? So it does come with a bunch of attachments. Um, all we gotta do is press this button right here. It unclips it and it lets it go out and then we could swap it with a new attachment. So see how that one blows out three of them? This one only blows one. The brushes, what I like about them too is that they're super easy to work with. So all you gotta do is clip them on and they're ready to go. Oh, you don't have easy? to screw them. You don't, uh, on my old one, you will have to screw it up and then unscrew it when it's ready to go. On this one, all you gotta do is clip it on and it's ready to be used. All right, one thing I did like about this is this attachment right here. We could use this to steam down carpets. It has a nice stiff brush to kind of scrub it out. And plus, it has this nice little clips where you could clip on a towel on it. So that way you don't have to tie it up. And yeah, this makes it a lot easier right here. So all, all you gotta do is fold up the towel on here and then clip it up and then it'll be on there right there. And then you get to rock it on the carpet. Up. So I don't know if you guys could kind of see it, but the towel, you could just fold it up and clip it onto this little clip so that way you don't have to tie it on and kind of tie it together. So once you attach it, you could go on the carpet and it'll steam it and it'll pick up all the dirt and grime that's on the carpet as you're steaming. All right, this attachment right here could make it easier for you to peel any type of stickers on windows, anything like that. It blows steam and at the same time you can scrape them out. I haven't tried this, but I'm pretty sure it works super good. All right, guys, this is the attachment for the vacuum steam. Um, this attachment goes into my steamer so it could blow out steam. Plus, it also attaches to my vacuum so it could extract all the water that's being pulled out the carpet or seats. I haven't tried it out, so we gotta do a test on this thing. We gotta try it out on the vehicle so we can see how it works. But, yep, it, look, it feels like it's working good, I mean, blowing steam, it's extracting it back up. So, I mean, that's all we need right there. But what I wanna know is that, is the cheap steamer worth my investment? Drop it down in the comments down below. And if you guys wanna see the cheap steamer in action, like, subscribe, and stay tuned to see the next video.